You guys have always kind of been able to bounce back even when you get down. What, what, why weren't you guys kind of able to make that run again tonight? Uh, we just hurt ourselves continuously. Um, offensively, we kept digging ourselves in third and long, and um, we were just weren't capitalizing. Uh, we were making mistakes. Um, we had a few penalties that you know kind of pushed us back in you know, third and 20, third and 22, et cetera. So uh, we just didn't, didn't execute at all of them. What can you put your finger on the, the offensive struggles tonight? I mean, you mentioned execution, some penalties, maybe. What? Uh, I mean, it was just overall game plan, game play for us. Um, you know, we had a good game plan and we felt confident in it. And uh, you know, there's just a certain few busts here and there that um, us as players we have to get fixed. Um, and you know, the leaders have to have to you know <clears throat> address that in this this upcoming week. And we have to make sure that you know we have, we we can still salvage this season and. Um, you know, not not look, overlook you know Sanford this last home home game for a bunch of the seniors and and go to Alabama you know with a vengeance. Is that the first time in a while you guys feel like you got beat at the line of scrimmage? Um, yeah, I, don't know, I mean a little bit. Uh, you know, we still I was looking at the, the whatever the little game sheet whatever we still had um, four plus yards per carry for for each running back. So uh, you know we felt like we we pretty, did a pretty good decent job. I was talking to Jonathan Jones, and he kind of mentioned it's kind of a time to sort of start over. You know, how do you, how do you get back on track? Is that a tough thing to deal with, considering you were number three just to, in the country just a couple of weeks ago? How do you, how do you yeah. move on? <clears throat> I mean, again, I think that, that falls back on the leaders of the team. Um, you know, we have to step up, and uh, you know, we were looking at the sideline, looking in the locker room, and it was kind of dead, and it was flat, and you know, that, that falls on the leadership of the team. Um, and you know, we'll get that fixed. Um, you know, the coaches did their job. You know, we have to do ours. Was that before the game flat or after game no, it was flat? No, it was. I mean, we, it was. You know, during halftime, you know, on the sideline a little bit. You know, we we know that there are going to be trials and tribulations throughout the game, and we have to, you know, bounce back from that. And um, we didn't do that today. And. Uh, you know, we played a very good team, um, and they executed at a high level. And we didn't. Had you felt that before, where you're like, "Whoa, everybody's kind of flat." I mean, has that happened in the um, past? Is that a first? Uh, I mean, you know, I, I, don't, I don't think so. Um, and, and it wasn't like it was, you know, completely dead. Right. Um, we had a lot of people stepping up, and, and you know, kind of trying to corral the team's morale and everything. But um, you know, when we got down, it was just uh, it was hard for us to bounce back, and um, that's usually something we're really good at. Can you put your finger yeah. on? Um, why you guys only scored seven tonight? Um, we, 